Hello and welcome to another Performance Architects How-To. Performance Architects is a business and technology consulting company that helps companies initiate and sustain big changes in their performance management and business intelligence environments and process. This video along with others on our channel should help provide some additional insight as you embark on or continue along your EPM and BI journey. Head over to our channel after this video or come back in the future to learn best practices, hear overviews, and take part in lessons we have designed to help you. We are focused on continuing to develop this community and we welcome any recommendations you might have for future content. Thanks and enjoy. Hello and welcome to Performance Architects How To. My name is Andy and in this session we are going to see how we can create auto-reversing journal entries in Oracle's Hyperion Financial Management. Imagine the scenario where the sales executive Joe from the North region closed a $100 million sale of raw cotton to the South region in the month of January. However, since the sale was to the end of the month and it takes time for South to process the paperwork, South will actually make the payment in the month of February. Now Joe needs to reflect the sale in the month of Jan. So he needs to make an adjustment to the Jan revenue to include the sale. At the same time, he needs to back out the additional amount from the February revenue. For this reason, he will post an auto-reversing journal entry for the month of January in HFM, which automatically creates a reversing entry for the month of February to back out the amount. If you look at the data file that, that automatically gets loaded into HFM by the monthly processes, for the month of January, see that the North to South revenue was $100 million as highlighted by the first line. The second highlighted line shows that for the month of February the North to South revenue was $200 million. This 200 includes the $100 million sale that Joe made. If you look at the data in HFM you see that for the month of January the revenue is shows as $100 million and for February it shows $200 million. To create the journal entry, Joe logs into HFM and clicks on Process Journals, ensuring that the POV has the correct year and the month. Select a new journal entry from the blank journal and choose Auto Reversing. Then enter a, a title for the journal entry. For simplicity's sake, we pick Unbalanced and the entity, the source entity is the, uh, the North region. We then enter the POV, since this is a revenue, we pick the account of revenue and the intercompany partner is South. The product in this case is raw cotton. And since the other dimension not being used, just pick the top of the house. Then enter the $100 million credit, which is revenue, and save the end. The journal entry has now the journal entry has now been loaded. Joe needs to then submit it for approval. An administrator would then log in and review the entry and after reviewing it would approve it. After approving it, the journal entry then needs to be posted in order to show up in the HFM application. Now since this is an auto-reversing journal entry, if we look in the month of February, a reversing entry has automatically been created. We see that the, deb the debit is now $100 million and it's, it has the status of approved it's because the original journal entry in the month of January was approved. The administrator will now post it to HFM. So after consolidating the and after consolidating the data in HFM, you see that hundred million dollars has moved from the month of February to the month of January. All it all journal entries post to the immediate parent or sorry the first parent of the the entities 
so that is why the amount shows at the parent which is the USA and not and not the North and South region themselves this is how Joe would create an auto reversing journal entry in Oracle's Hyperion Financial Management thank you for joining and please visit performance architects how to channel for other videos on enterprise performance management and business intelligence solutions